Well, this is certainly a difficult starting spot. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to more family-friendly gaming with Soap the Great. What are we doing? Where are we? This doesn't look like vanilla, and it doesn't look like material energy. No, this is... Oh, I just need a... I didn't need the stone binding. That's cool. I want an axe. Okay, no, we are on the Hypermine modded server. We're playing FTB Infinity Evolved. And, yeah, I'm just getting started up. we got a little hidey hole right there. And I think somebody is right there, but I'm not sure. All right? I'm not sure who that might be. But let me just show you real quick once I knock down this oak. And I like the advanced leaf decay. That's really nice. Let's go here. You can see who all has been online. Nimson is currently online with me, but Valentine's been on, Benito's Lair, Dolan, Ector, Fluent Chaos, Condrick, Lapis, Late Night Tick, Prezi, Teal Lone Wolf. He's been playing for two days and eight hours, and he is well armored up. Okay, and Voodoo Beard with the iron armor going. So I currently don't have any armor, and so uh, we'll see if... Nimson pops into a bed here soon. It's got something where if I think it's one third of everybody gets in on a bed or does the sleep thing, or at least one third, then everybody or, or the whole thing switches. So we shall see. I'm just going to be doing some mining, however. What I want to do is talk a little bit while I take care of some of these initial things here. Um, we want to just go over what the plan is. Okay, so um, I need I need a shovel. Do I have a tool rod? I already have a tool rod. So I want to get some... I'm going to get rid of that. Alright, so as you might have been noticing, I've been playing a little bit of modded and uh, that's been on the Material Energy Quest Pack. And uh, if you've been watching that you and you know modded, then you might have been doing a lot of face palming. Why? Because I don't know modded, but uh, I am thinking that here in a multiplayer world... Oh, the sound's back. It was gone for a bit. I'll sleep. Um, in a multiplayer environment, I can interact a little bit more with everybody and uh, and hopefully progress a little bit faster and one of the things right now that I need is make sure I don't suffocate but I need some clay that's what I really want uh, there's a tool that I got in in the my uh, what is it uh, material energy called the lumber axe okay so the lumber axe is really cool as soon as you knock down a tree it takes out everything, it takes out all the connected wood. And I've kind of gotten used to that, and I really want to make one. So I tried putting together all of the elements for it, and I found out you need a tool forge, and a tool forge requires seared brick and a bunch of iron. Now, I'm still trying to figure out the mining situation here, and that means that I need to get a, an ore doubling thing set up, so we need a little grindstone, and I will show you what we're going for here. Oh man, going against the water current. Okay, there we go, there we go. All right, I got plenty of clay, so we can smelt up or make some grout and then smelt that up. See, the sound's gone again. All right, so what we need is a, let me show you real quick, tool forge. I'm sorry, my uh, voice. I need to wet the whistle a little bit here. A little sip of water. Let's bring up Tool Forge. And here we go. Nope. Right here. Needs a space. Let me show you. We need four blocks of iron and then seared bricks. Let's see what seared bricks are. Seared bricks are made of that. And so you smelt grout. Grout you make with sand and clay and gravel. 
So that's why I've gotten the clay. We're going to work towards a tool forge, but in terms of the the iron, we need a grindstone. Uh, we could go with like a tinker smeltery. There is one at a spawn village that, uh, let's see if I can bring up the map. Why does it do that? I want it to not do that. It's like it it completely messed up or, or reset my whole journey map. Hmm. That's a problem. There, I've got an initial spawn point set over here. Nimson's base is right here. There's a little spawn village hanging out right in this area, I believe. And there's a Tinker Smeltery there. I could use that, but I really want to try out some of this stuff. So what I'm going to be doing is making a grindstone. And you can see what we require there. We need some Certus Quartz. We've got the wooden gear already, and we've got plenty of stone already from just mining out down there but I am going to pop down and we'll try and find some Certus Quartz here. Um, you're supposed to be on level 17 to 69. I don't know if there is a particular height at which you need to go in that level, but we'll start here. This is as good a place as any. And we'll just go like this. Oh, I see we've got, what is that? Copper ore. That's useful, so we'll grab that. All right, so while I do some of this uh, grindy work here trying to find some Certus Quartz ore. What we're going to do is just chat. What's that? Aluminum. Okay, I need that. Um, what is modded going to do for the channel? How is it going to work in what we're already working on? So, you know, Hypermind Vanilla is my main series. 10, okay. I'm, I'm just in collection mode at the moment. So if you're face palming because I'm collecting stuff that might seem rather common, it's because I'm not really sure about it. So Hypermind Vanilla is my main one. We've got plenty of projects going on there. And uh, let's see if we can do this. Is that the only one? Um, and then I've also got the material energy, right? So. The material energy is probably going to take a backseat because I prefer the multiplayer experience here. It's rather slow. I need some flint. Uh, are we going to get flint out of a stone stone shovel? We should. Getting a little bit of lag. Ooh, Certus Quartz. Yes. Okay. That's what I needed. And I hope I didn't open anything up. Okay. Good. Uh, we need blocks on the bar. That might might be useful. Just do some dirt. Come on. Place. Place. Okay. Thank you for finally placing. All right. Uh, what is this going to do? Well, we will still do the material energy from time to time. We got, we got plenty. Is that, is that going to be enough? We need three. Yes. Okay. So I should be able to smelt that up. Get that going. Um, so this is probably, this is going to take primary importance on the channel. We're getting a little bit of block lag or a little bit of lag here. Um, and we will get back to material energy, uh, in the future. But right now I really want to focus a little bit on here and get going. Now, how is this going to go? Uh, there's not going to be regular episodes. Instead, what I am thinking is going to happen is I'm going to smelt some cobblestone. We'll just do that, throw that in. Um, what I'm going to do is uh, we will focus on streaming, okay? So we're going to stream the, the progress, okay? And uh, that means that you can go check out twitch.tv slash mcsoapthegreat and, uh, and see what's going on in terms of the, of how modded is going, okay? And that's broken. Do I have another shovel? Hopefully I have another shovel. Oh, of course we can just repair this. That's a neat thing about tinkers. Chuck that in there. Chuck some stone. Fully repaired. No, no um, XP required. 
And I really miss Depth Strider. We're going to get to Traveler's Boots somehow. All right, so what we're going to do is stream FTB. And then what, what I will then do is get highlights from the stream. And then we'll also have um, kind of a recap. So we'll try and do a weekly recap. And we'll see how that goes, OK? If that is something that you think would work, you know, let me know in the comments below. And if you don't like that idea, let me know that as well. OK, we got flowing water right there. You know what? We'll just chuck some dirt and right there, too. And we'll take this and put some more dirt. All right, so we're working towards the, the lumber axe because I really want to be able to easily chop down all those things. Um, not really chop down all of those, but I'm not setting up here for long term. I'm. This is just a hidey hole. Okay, so I've got a little waypoint. You can see it right there, hidey hole, and I've got it marked. Um, so we're going to be streaming, and uh, that's going to be our focus. Okay, so let's see where's the tinker table? It's not really a tinker table anymore. Let me get my gear. The neat thing about the tool about this particular table is that no 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 let me make sure I get this right this is the first time I have crafted something like this is that gonna work yes got it all right next we need something to run the grindstone um, there's a little stick that goes in there and I don't know what the term for it is oh handle handle maybe grind handle I'm gonna have to look this up so yeah I will do that off camera real quick make sure let me do that off camera and uh, we'll come back and see what this thing gets us all right back in a bit all right we're back it's called a wooden crank so there we go we got that place that in there there we go all right and then what I can do is put put the iron ore in here and then I just and it'll stop eventually once that's all done so we really need to get a, a more automated ore doubling situation set up and we'll get to a tinker smeltery eventually. But right now I just wanted to try this out. All right, so we're going to be streaming. And you can find the links to that channel in the description box below. And then what we're going to do is weekly recap. If if there's enough, uh, enough progress going on for the recap. But um, we'll eventually get to where we have our own little base somewhere out in the world. And if you've got some ideas for how... Oh, I guess I guess it's all no, it's still it's still working on one. If you've got some ideas for a biome you'd like to see me set up in, do let me know in the comments below or send it to me via um what is it? Email. Okay. That would be good. And we can just do this. And I think one iron dust gets us an ingot, which means that out of the six, um out of those six or we will have gotten, yeah, one ingot. Awesome. I like that. Okay, so we are on our way to getting the uh, tinker or the tool forge. And so I'm going to take care of the rest of this grindy stuff off camera. And then when we come back, we'll get that tool forge going. And hopefully I can make my lumber axe. All right, back in a bit. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're back, and you can see I've already got my tool forge. And between the time I last recorded and now, we've got a lot of progress. Okay, so I made the seared brick, I made the tool forge, and you remember it. Oh man, he is just going crazy with those achievements. This thing required some iron blocks, and I did the grindstone for a little while, and I got tired of grinding all that ore, so. I figured since I had made all those seared bricks already, I might as well just make a smeltery. And there we go. So the smeltery is really where I got all of the iron blocks from for this. 
and you can see from around here if you are familiar with modded that I've been rather busy yeah so we got a turtle here we got a tank here for lava an igneous extruder magma crucible which is not hooked up to anything I just placed it down and then over here we've got some generators making some RF well right now they're quiet because uh, they're all done they've burnt through their fuel and they're filling up this capacitor which is powering right now two pulverizers and an induction smelter and then eventually an alloy smelter so yeah we've been getting going on the automation and the machines and I've also gotten some some moss going so I could put the auto repair modifier on this pick and I've also maxed out the luck and haste on here and if you notice if I go this way a little tool tip right here there's one and then there's another yes I've died a couple times this one was to zombies and this one was to a witch yeah so I was doing some caving on both of them and just got overwhelmed well, I didn't really have much no armor or anything and and then over here I I for some reason thought I had run out of toast and or didn't realize what was what it was that was in my inventory and I thought I was hungry and um, I didn't eat and she got me with the poison and then the harming oh well anyway we've got turtles going which has been very helpful to fill up over here you see that we've got a bunch of ores a bunch of pulverized ores we've been using the pulverizer and we're having some issues on the server right now these things okay there we go if we go down here, I'm going to show you what the turtles have been doing. Found a program that Hector or Hector gave me the program for a branch mine, and then built into the turtle is tunnel, which is responsible for this clearing out, and excavate, which is responsible for these four holes in the ground. And so the turtles have been very, very useful, getting me those resources. And yeah, I'm I'm sold on turtles. But um, anyway, so what's the plan from here? You can see I've done a lot of progress, and we're going to be continuing this. But I've just been having fun playing it and not really worrying about recording. And um, and we're going to continue that. Okay. So I'm sorry that I'm not bringing you along for everything and showing you all the progress and doing kind of tutorials along the way. There's plenty of other tutorials out there for it. I'm just having fun learning. And hey, if you if you want to just play along, grab the FTB Infinity Evolve Pack. It's in the FTB Launcher. And let me know if you'd like me to take a look at any particular mods. Um, I'm enjoying the automation stuff right here. What's this from? This is Extra Utilities, and then this is Ender I.O., this thermal expansion, so they all kind of work together. That's Ender IO thermal expansion. So I'm really enjoying some of those and uh, computer craft with the turtles. I'm not really worrying about programming them. I do programming on my day job, and it's not really something that I care to do as a hobby. So I will look to other people who have written cool programs, and I'll just use those. But um, but yeah, so. What's next? Well, next on the list, we need to get flight because I really want to um, explore elsewhere. I mean, we've got spawn over that way. Ector's building right there. Spawn's not too far away. I want to kind of branch out a bit. And we need flight to be able to go around and search for all that. And then once we do find a suitable spot, I need to move all this stuff. And so we're going to be using some golden bags of holding and hopefully getting all of this stuff into a few of those and then moving out. So we're gonna just tear all this apart and head on out, which is pretty exciting. If you have any suggestions for biomes where you think I should hang out, let me know in the comments below. If there's any mods you'd like me to check out, go check out the list on the FTB launcher or on the website for FTB and let me know what you think. But uh, that's gonna be it for now. Oh, I finally did get my lumber axe. You know what? Just for, just for the sake of using it, nobody's around. Yeah. Okay. I've, I've come to, 
uh, respect the overall danger of modded and uh, I'm I'm a little more careful than I usually am in vanilla but uh, there we go I finally I don't are those are those guys mean I don't know if they're mean I, I just leave them alone um, yeah I think he generates in that hut over there that's it's not somebody's hut I think it's a generated structure I could be wrong do correct me if I am but uh, yeah so I got my lumber axe we're gonna be upgrading that here soon with something from that's gonna make charcoal but I need stuff from the nether which means I need flight for that as well so we're gonna be working on flight and I'm gonna be doing that on stream so twitch.tv slash MC soap the great and that's going to be it for now, ladies and gentlemen. Feel free to leave your comments and questions down in the description box below. But again, hopefully you have enjoyed this installment of Family Friendly Gaming with Soak the Great. If I'm not comfortable sharing it with my kids, I'm not going to share it with you. That's it for now. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.